Hey everybody, it's Rob with Anderson Barbecue Supply. Today, we're gonna to be cooking up some simple chicken wings. All right, thanks everybody for joining in today. Like I said, today we're just gonna be doing some simple chicken wings. We get people inside our store all the time that overcomplicate things and don't really realize how easy, good grilling, barbecue, smoking, different foods is most of the time. So without further ado, we're gonna get right into it. I just got a, uh, looks like about a dozen chicken wings here that we picked up at the local grocery store. I am going to cut those open. And I believe these are whole wings. I cut all the nice wrapping that we get. And what we're gonna do is, we're actually gonna cut these down a little bit because these are whole party wings. Um, these have the little flappers on it, you can see there. So we're gonna take those and we are gonna separate those just because they're gonna get overcooked. Most people don't like them. But easiest part, take a sharp knife, slice it right off, good to go. Throw that to the side, put that knuckle in there, nice sharp knife. Let's see, and go from that side. <clears throat> I'm just gonna cut off these little flappers as most people call them. Some people really like them. All right, now that we got that done, we're gonna lay these out on my prep tub here, which is one of the nicest things I think we have. Uh, we're gonna spray some duck fat as a binder, and then we're gonna season these guys up and make it nice and simple. So, got our duck fat here. This is gonna give us a little binder on top of these wings. Today we're gonna be using Hot Dirty Bird, as well as Honey Killer Bee, both from Cosmos. Both a really good line. This will give it a really good color with a kick of kick of heat in it. Honey Killer Bee over the top of that. Give it a little sweetness. Pretty easy there. We're gonna flip them. Give them another shot of duck fat. We'll be using duck fat later too to uh, crisp up the skin in the smoker. Nice generous coating. Don't be shy. Easy enough. Come back with a little honey on top. All right, now that we got these seasoned up, uh, another little trick I have is generally when I put these in the smoker, I like to put them on a cooling tray so that they're easily movable on and off. So we have super simple cooling rack, cookie sheet. You can buy them at almost any grocery store. We sell them at Anderson Barbecue Supply here in Vadness Heights and online as well. So we're just going to take our chicken, throw it on there. Makes it easy when you're putting things on and off the smoker. You don't have to worry about touching every piece or using the tongs. It's just one big thing you're moving. So now that we got those on there, uh, we are running a pellet smoker today. Like I said, uh, we're doing some simple things here with our YouTube channel. And we're going to keep it really simple. So a lot of these smokes will be done in our pellet smoker because that's what a lot of people are using. Uh, today we're using a... Smokin' Brothers American-made pellet smoker from down in southern Missouri. And I got the smoker set at 225 degrees. We'll probably roll these for about an hour at that till we get some smoke on them. And then we'll up the temperature, shoot them with some duck fat, and try to get that crispy skin on them too. So let's get them in. A lot of times lately I've been using my upper rack. Lay it in there. We're going to set it. We'll see you guys back in a little bit. All right, guys, welcome back. We've been cooking these chicken wings for about 45 minutes at about 225 degrees. Let's take a look at them right now. They're looking pretty good. They got some color on them. Uh, that skin isn't quite cutting it though. So what we're gonna do is pull them out. We're gonna spray them with some duck fat. 
We're cranking the heat on this pellet smoker and we'll see what happens. Got those good to go. They're gonna sit in there. We're cranking this to 450 and we'll see what we come up with in just a little bit. All right, everybody, we've got these chicken wings in the Smoking Brothers pellet smoker now for, we did about an hour up front, 45 minutes to an hour up front at 225. Now they've been in there about another 40 minutes at about 450, uh, right around 400 degrees on the upper rack. I had some duck fat that we sprayed on earlier to help crisp up those skins. And right now you can actually, I don't know if you can hear it, I can hear it, but we're definitely uh, got a lot of crisp going here. We're gonna temp a couple of these wings. Yeah, we're up towards 190, which obviously 165 for chicken is what you need uh, to be safe. But on pellet smokers, you can go up quite a bit longer. Uh, it's still gonna be tender, it's still gonna be moist, just due to the pellet grill keeping all that moisture inside. So pull these off, let that go. And then we're gonna transfer some of the wings here. Yeah, these are looking pretty good. If you wanted some more flavor, you could shake a little more Dirty Bird on there, whatever you want. But the whole point of this video is keeping things simple. So we got the whole wings to start. We clipped off the flapper, disposed of that. Duck fat for our binder, seasoning on, flipped them over, did the same thing. Put them on the cookie rack, onto the smoker for about 45 minutes to an hour at 225. Then we upped the temperature to about 450, 400 degrees, threw more duck fat on there try to get a nice crispy skin. Uh, today, like I said, we used Cosmos, Honey Killer Bee, and Dirty Bird, Hot Dirty Bird, which is a great combo for me. There's lots of other good things out there. One of our best sellers in the store at Anderson Barbecue Supply is the Croy Valley Foods line of uh, wing boosters. They have a mango habanero, hickory smoke. Uh, they have a couple other ones too, ginger teriyaki that are really good and that's just a more fine powder than what you would find in a normal seasoning. So keep it simple, don't overthink it. I'm gonna let these cool off for just a minute and then give them a try and we'll see what we got. All right, we've let these cool off. We kept it nice and simple. Let's see if that paid off. You can see that skin already. They're still hot. Really good flavor. Get that kick with the Cosmos Dirty Bird. Pretty good bite through skin. Not perfect, but you know, we're not cranking this thing up to 600, 700 degrees anyways. So definitely definitely worth it. Super simple recipe. Try it out. If you guys like what you saw today in our video, like us, subscribe. We're going to keep putting new videos out. As always, everything that we're going to be cooking with is going to be sold in our store, AndersonBBQSupply.com. Check us out on uh, social media. We'll see you soon.